Dockers defender Brennan Cox has revealed how a summer skateboarding accident landed him in hospital, putting his pre-season at risk. The 24-year-old was happy to cop criticism from footy commentators, taking on the feedback and now eyeing a career-best season. He's a crucial part of Frio's formidable defence. Brennan Cox cracks him. Will he let him get past? He's got hold of him. Oh, Cox with a huge play. Brennan Cox among the game's elite defenders, but a skateboarding incident over summer threatening his pre-season. Oh, my dog walks next or runs next to me. He sort of just rode into the shoulder of the kerb and, and just went straight onto the road. Yeah, so ripped open all the all my hand and, and the knee um, and sort of went back to training with the glove and then a bit of mud or something got in there and infected it and got into my bloodstream and just how easy it can happen and yeah that was in hospital. The accident leading some to question his professionalism. Probably a fair whack as I, I missed a bit of pre-season and whatnot but yeah boys have their, their things out of out of footy which I'll probably just stick to golf from now on. Back on the track and ready for round one resuming his close partnership with all Australian teammate Luke Ryan one that wasn't always smooth sailing. Hated each other at the start but then then became really good friends and lived together so uh, we've got a really good connection on the field it almost feels like we don't have to talk to each other we just just read each other really well. Cox aiming to join Ryan claiming his own jacket part of the 40-man squad last year. Cox was outstanding again. It's always good to get that recognition and um, something I want to build on. I do eventually want to be in that um, all Australian team. Extending his stay at Coburn on the agenda, dreaming of being part of something special. Yeah, I actually spoke to my manager yesterday about um, yeah, what, what, what's next and when we start talking and, and whatnot. I really want to be the first group that um, wins a, a flag at Fremantle. So, yeah, at this stage, I'm, I'm happy here. Mitch Turner, Nine News.